Paris is a Ruby Rags World of Dolls and welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope that all is well, fantastic, and fabulous your way. I am back, yay, with another um, doll review and unboxing. This is a new addition to my collection and I'm so excited about this doll. This is a limited addiction. Edition. This is the Meteor Collection. This is a IT doll and she is absolutely gorgeous. I didn't even know that IT was releasing this, this basic line. You guys know that's how I was able to get my three, four, my four beauty, beautiful IT dolls in my collection. You know, the IT dolls are very pricey. They are well worth every penny that you pay. The clothes are just breathtaking and so detailed they are basic they're basically in my opinion miniature upscale fashions <laughs> and they are worth every penny that you pay because they are so much work that goes into these pieces and these these um fashions and um i'm just so glad that i was able to get my hands on some of these dolls and adding them into my collection you know and I'm just so grateful that they're giving us this basic line so they have released another basic line and there's four dolls in this line as well and I'm so thrilled now I got one here and we're gonna unbox her and we're gonna check her out this was my first choice though I want them all but I've already promised to myself that I was only going to get two of them max two of them so I had to choose two of the four and this was my first choice and I'm hoping that they don't sell out before I am able to get my hands on the other one that I want so that's where I'm at I told you guys I'm being so I'm being so good. I'm sticking with the budget. I'm sticking with my promise to myself. So there that is. So we're going to get this beautiful doll out of the box. And we're going to look at her up close and in detail. Alright guys. I wanted to show you guys the doll out of the box. I'm in the box before I removed her from the box. So this is how she comes in the box. For those of you that are first timers to this channel. Or someone who's first time to actually see an, I, an IT Integrity Toys doll and how well they're packaged and how nice they do things. It's like it's simple, classic, elegant, and to the point, you know. Not, a, not any wastefulness. Everything is just done so fabulous. So this is her in her packaging and how she comes packaged. And I just wanted you guys to see that. A hairnet and all she's you know so we're going to talk more about what she comes with but i wanted you guys to see her still in the packaging before i removed her all right let me introduce to you pose like an egyptian amara majid basic doll this is her so i think i'm i'm hoping i'm pronouncing amara's name correctly majid Amara Majid posed like an Egyptian. So she was my first choice when I looked at all four dolls. There are four dolls in this new basic um, release. And um, for those of you that are going to ask me in the comments, how do you get this doll? Guys, I say it in every unboxing that I have done of these dolls. Go to IntegrityToys.com and it'll take you right to the site and just click on shop online but right now when you go to the site the first thing that's going to pop up is to is the basic dolls so you know there's four different dolls and um they're all beautiful and have fun so integritytoys.com is the site that you go to so Again, this doll is absolutely gorgeous. Amara is gorgeous. So I did not take her hair net off because I wanted to do that with you guys. I want to show you guys what she comes with. She comes with these beautiful um, large gold hoops. She comes with a pair, a second pair of hands, grip hands is what I think they call them in the description. And she comes with these gorgeous wedge sandals. 
gorgeous wet sandals and she also comes with her certificate of authenticity check it out the plastic i know the plastic is about to be a, such a glare but isn't she such a gorgeous doll this doll is absolutely stunning she's gorgeous i just realized that she is my third um doll from the meteor collection so i guess it's something about the meteor collection that i'm attracted to <laughs> because i have three of them now with amara and um she's absolutely gorgeous so this is the certificate of authenticity and she is an ad the addition size is ple i have 1114 of 1500 dolls so that's the addition size for this doll so, and I'm really, really excited to have her. So that's her certificate of authenticity and her accessories. Without any more waiting, let's go ahead and release all this beautiful, long black hair by releasing her hairnet. So there we are. So let's turn around and look at this long, beautiful hair. I was just attracted to the beautiful face and, of course, the difference with the hairstyle and all. You know, I don't have an integrity doll with this hairstyle. So, of course, and I never can get them on the stand properly. And then, too, she's not wearing her shoes. And I've noticed that the shoes make a difference. So, this is the hair. Again, excellent quality. They are twist with um, some kind of ties on the end. It's like it's thread. It's like it's thread. Thread, I guess. Whatever these pieces, ties on the end, they're there. They're on there. So I don't have to worry about taking them off. I don't have to worry about the hair coming on loose unless I remove the ties. All right. So we're turning her back around to the front to that beautiful, gorgeous face. These dolls have rooted eyelashes. I love the dark blue eyeshadow. And I just love that serious look. A lot of people say these dolls have that... Um, that bitch stare <laughs> excuse my french but it's the truth they all have that um stuck up um stuck up bitch stare like they can stare a hole right through you i think these dolls are absolutely gorgeous now i'm not a fan of all of the it dolls i think some of them you know some of them just don't appeal to me but the fifth five dolls that i have chosen for my collection i love them all i mean they are super models they're super models they're tall sl they're tall long legs um perfect waist perfect everything that's what these supermodels are right all right so let me take her off the stand so she does come with her stand you know you got the metal base and that plastic clip there and then you've got the um the meteor um, design right there um, logo there and it's a really nice stand if you learn how to put the doll on that stand it is a great stand I have all four of my dolls displayed on a shelf mounted on the wall on their stands and now I'm going to have to put the fourth shelf up because I don't have any more room on that shelf to put another doll but here she is she's wearing this adorable white this white swimsuit, that two-piece swimsuit that ties around her body, as you can see. That's a, is that a thread that's supposed to be there? I'm not going to take that off. I don't think that's supposed to be there, though. I think that's supposed to, um, I'm supposed to take that off. But I'm going to leave it there for now till I investigate. But here is the way it looks in the back, the two pieces. You know, these Meteor dolls have, from the side, I want you to see, they have quite a quite a bit junk in their trunk, okay? <laughs> they're built that way. They're thicker, they're thicker in the trunk, and they're just perfect in how it ties around the waist. You know, I'm going to hate taking her out of this, because I know I'm probably never going to get to tie it back as pretty as they have it tied. I've never been good with tying bows. And guys, check out her, check out her Manny. Her hand, her mani is gorgeous. I love those nails. I just love those nails. I love them. And then she has a petty as well. You know, these dolls are gorgeous. These dolls are gorgeous. And I am so grateful that IT gave us these basic dolls because these dolls are very pricey. And to get these basic dolls 
for a hundred a little over a hundred dollars you know it's it's a great it's great because again like i said everything is miniature size you know you're not getting doll clothes you're getting a bathing suit a real bathing suit and miniature size for it all i mean let's look at that gorgeous face yes let her give you that stare <laughs> and of course their ears come pierced and i want to give you guys a look at the hair again it's gorgeous 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 and then that beautiful manicure it's gorgeous i love those colors blue and gold long those manicures are nice so let me see if i can get her back on the stand so i can get her um her accessories opened all right so these are her i'm not going to open these hands but even the second set of hands come well you want to see them because i know some of you are waiting for the review to decide if you're going to get them and then like i said you saw the addition size so you see that it's not a large number and when you're talking worldwide that's not a big number all right so here are the grip hands and it has the same um same manicure gorgeous just gorgeous all right so let's get these shoes get these shoes unboxed while you guys just stare at that beautiful doll Yes, I've fallen in love. I've fallen in love with the IT dolls. Now I just have to get my hand on at least one guy. If I could just get my hands on just one. And I don't mean just any one. I want it to be the one that I want. Check out these shoes. These are miniature shoes, not plastic. These are miniature shoes. This is why you the price point is what it is. I love this. I love these shoes. I love these shoes. These shoes are gorgeous they're gorgeous all right so let me see i hope that i don't have to unhook the buckle and all to get them on because like i said these are these are miniature fashions so guys i'm going to try to get her shoes and accessories on off camera and we'll be right back all right Everything was okay putting on. Her earrings were went right in. You know, I've heard um, IT doll collectors that have been collecting for a while say that sometimes you have to stretch the ear hole a little bit to get the earrings in. And I have four. This is my fifth one. And I've never had to do that. So, you know, but that sometimes they recommend you might have to do, especially if you don't want to break your earrings because the earrings are gorgeous again these are miniature items you know not doll stuff but miniature stuff for real and i mean they're just gorgeous and then the shoes oh my goodness guys the shoes let me give you guys a look at these shoes these shoes are gorgeous i love them and the shoes were not hard to get on either but i will say this if you're going to do it accessories especially like with the shoes you might need to invest in some tweezers you know because these are real details of shoes you know it's got the little buckle the little strap there and all that you have to loosen a little bit to get the doll's foot in the shoe because you know it's all little real details i love these wedges i love them they're absolutely gorgeous this is a gorgeous doll amara is a beautiful addition to my my little small IT collection and I am not trying to collect as many IT dolls as I do Barbie dolls but I am excited to have the few that I have I definitely want to get me a couple of males I really do because the male dolls are stunning as well I don't like all of them there's a few of them that I like but I definitely would like to have a few males I thought that they were going to put a male in the basic collection. You know, I don't know if that doll, if he'll come later or if he's even going to come. I do know that there was a basic male doll, but I don't know if he was an exclusive to members only. You know, I didn't join because I didn't, I, I wasn't sure if I was going to invest that money into a doll i've heard a lot of people that paid the membership say that you know they only bought one doll some people say they didn't even buy any dolls so you know i'm kind of pleased right now since i'm new to it 
with these basic dolls that they're offering. You know, I'm really, really pleased with them and I'm satisfied with them. You know, and sometimes you can get lucky enough that you can, they sell some of the fashions. I was able to get a beautiful um, Poppy Parker fashion set for, um, I guess, the normal price. Look, <laughs> the the fashions can cost as much as the dolls. Let's just go and put it out there. But again, you know, they're an investment because these are definitely dolls that people can, people will resale and people will buy, guys. I've seen people buy the dolls and keep the um, fashions and sell the dolls. So it's like they get the fashions and they sell the dolls because people want the dolls. So, you know, it's kind of like an investment. It's kind of like American Girl was at one time. You know, American Girl dolls at one time, you could buy the dolls and the, the price, um, the value um, stayed the same. It's like if you spent $115, you could resell that doll. Depending on how popular that doll was, sometimes you could sell that doll for twice, sometimes three times the money that you paid for it. So, you know, these IT dolls kind of are like that. You know, it's like they're an investment and, you know, they don't depreciate value. They usually, you know, stay the same or go up depending on the, the, the demand of them. So, if you guys are interested in the basic dolls and then, like I said, there's four of them and I have my eyes on one more because I said I was only going to get two and there is one more that I want to get because I want different face sculpts I want different bodies um different body um types and um I have my eyes on one more and I'm just praying that you know she's stays available until I can get her because I'm sticking to my budget you know there's so many beautiful dolls coming out but I can rarely keep up with them. You know, I can barely keep up, you know. We got the mermaid and um, the live action little mermaid dolls coming out. But I've made a promise to myself, guys, and I'm not going crazy with all those dolls. I'm only going to get the ones that I know that I won't grow tired of down the road and have to sell and take a loss. I definitely want the six, the six sisters with the mermaid. I made up my mind that I definitely want to get that. Not sure if I'm going to get the Ursula doll. I want King Titan, but I have to see how he looks before I jump into that. I would like to have Prince Eric, but we'll just have to wait and see. But my biggest thing is those sisters. I've always wanted the um, Little Mermaid sisters, and that six, that seven doll set is on my radar it's in my it's in my it's on my list to get and that is my goal if i get that i will be pleased with my live action little mermaid dolls because i already see a spot here on my wall that i want to display them and that's where i'm trying to stay i want to have a place for it when i get it i don't want to get it and it's going to sit somewhere in a box and I don't get to enjoy it because I'm really enjoying my dolls more because now that I got the doll room kind of set up the way I want it, having the dolls on display so when I come in here I can see all my beautiful dolls. You know, I'm just really, really loving it and I'm so excited about it. And I'm trying to stick with that, with that, with that in mind. I'm trying to say, okay... What are you going to do with it when you get it? So I have in mind what I want to do with that seven pack of mermaids. That seven set with mermaid and her six sisters. They are beautiful. The face sculpts are amazing. And the price point, everybody might say is too high. But when you look at how many dolls you're getting and you divide it into how much each doll costs, it's a, it's a reasonable price and it's what we pay for the dolls anyway. So, I'm really, really excited. So, guys, I hope that you enjoy this unboxing and review of my new beautiful doll. I'm just so excited to be adding her to my collection. The post, like an Egyptian, Amara Majid. She is gorgeous. I can't wait to take some photographs of her. I'm loving her in her, her, her swimsuit. I'm loving this swimsuit. I'm just loving this doll. I'm just admiring her the way she is. But I would definitely be trying to get her some 
some fashions later on so you know she looks good these dolls are gorgeous dolls gorgeous gorgeous dolls all right guys so you know the drill <laughs> don't forget to like comment share and subscribe don't forget to check us out on instagram we are ruby reds world of dolls there continue being awesome fantastic and fabulous and i will see you awesome amazing people in my next video <laughs>